I'm going to work with end range rotations and axials. So first I'm going to do some end range rotations. So with a maximum uh, effort, wherever my max safe effort is, trying to find the end range of my controlled articular rotation circle. So the overall big circle, now I'm working within the big circle with smaller circles to the limit or to the end range of my capacity in all of those directions. And then I'll slowly transition into axials, small, even smaller circles within the circles where I'm trying to turn, you know, deep inside of the joint, but still traveling through a big circle. So this is really an ideal way to gain some control back, carve out some space, but start to get some strengthening process into that shoulder.